Hey there, happy Friday. We finally caught a break from the rain, so I thought I would come and share this beautiful day with you. Did you know that the Boys and Girls Clubs of the Mississippi Valley has a vital mission here in the Quad Cities? Did you know that we serve more than 700 children and teenagers every year? It's amazing. We truly have a group of dedicated staff and volunteers who are willing to do whatever it takes to serve these kids and to make sure that they have every opportunity to succeed in life. You know, I might be a little bit biased, but I'd say that we are outstanding in our field. Well, a field. I'm not really sure whose field this is I'm outstanding in, but I've got some Friday updates for you. Thanks for joining. The rain started again, so welcome back inside. We're two months into this quarantine and I'm running out of jokes. I'm getting desperate, so send me your ideas. Since our update last week, we had great turnouts at our packet pickups. It was great to see many of our parents and even some of our members. I also had the pleasure of working with one of our members and some of our youth development professionals on a fun, collaborative project with Sarah over at First Tee of the Quad Cities. I'll share that with you when it's available. The administrative team and board of directors of the Boys and Girls Clubs of the Mississippi Valley is carefully watching the officials and experts from both Illinois and Iowa as it pertains to public health and COVID-19. We continue to adjust our response plan in order to meet the daily critical needs of the children we serve, and their safety is our first priority. We will continue with virtual programming and packet pickups until the experts tell us that it is safe once again to serve our members in our facilities. When that time comes, we will let you know. In the meantime, please consider making a gift to our clubs so that our staff are fully equipped to welcome our members back as soon as possible. Please visit bgcmv.org for more details. It's time for this week's shout outs. Our first shout out goes to Wells Fargo. During this time of financial uncertainty for many, Wells Fargo has stepped up to help families across the country find resources they need to thrive. When Wells Fargo learned that the Boys and Girls Clubs of the Mississippi Valley needed support to produce program materials, without hesitating, they sent us a check for $3,000. Their gift is much appreciated and it came at a time where giving to our organization has slowed down due to the climate surrounding COVID-19. Thank you very much, Wells Fargo. Our second shout out goes to graduating seniors, the class of 2020. Education is a big deal. The standards that we put in place for high school graduation are designed to prepare our children to be successful in life. There is a lot to be celebrated when a student graduates, and much of that celebration, the pomp and circumstance, is being foregone this year. That doesn't mean that we're forgetting, and it doesn't mean that we aren't proud of you. We are. We have two graduating seniors this year in our teen centers, Hannah and Heaven. We are so proud of both of you and all of the class of 2020. You are smart, dedicated, and prepared to take on the world. Congratulations. Well, that's all I have for you this week. To Hannah, Heaven, and everyone out there in quarantine land, be strong, courageous, and most importantly, be a friend to those in need. Until next time, have a great weekend. <laughs>